The Ibeno Estate owned Beno Investment and Property Company, BIPC, he don't clear the air for the matter of about 44 of their staff when they pursue from service. The matter is a source of controversy as report claims they target some local government areas. The managing director of BIPC, Barrister Alex Adum, he said they do the work out to boost the financial strength of the company and throw a claim when they concern the governor, Samuel Otom. He said they pursue up the staff now because of Karidu when they say it don't cost Wala. To the company. The disengagement exercise is not targeted at any particular local government. Like I said, three principles determine the disengagement exercise. Last in, last out. I mean, first out. Incidentally, when you are not doing employment based on a business deal like Julius would do, and you're not headhunting, talent to improve value and add value to your organization. The temptation for me, sitting as the MD of BIPC, once we allow politics to take over the decisions we make, is to bring in my relations and my associates. Oto never influenced the employment exercise in BIPC. Because if he did, he will first take care of his own home. Because everybody is first and foremost his father's son before he is the community or the society's child. Why will Otom allow employment in BIPC in that number, 150 people employed in three years, and Otom will not be able to employ anybody from the local government, where he comes from? Truth is, some smart guys sat in BIPC as managers and decided to compromise our common wealth and are using their contacts in the social media to blackmail us from doing the right work. 